Okay, um, so we go on YouTube. Now, um, I've showed this puppet off before. This is a. I think I've got an idea what I want to do with it as a um, usable, remixable type showcase character. Um, it's going to have eyebrows some sort of hair and obviously I want to do something with the feet to make it look like it's a shoes on but this here is a um, as it says a test skirt to fill the waters to see if people think the test skirt's good enough I'm not keen on it like it's okay but it's like I would like to tweak it but if people think this is okay then I might just tweak this one instead of making a new one from scratch but it's a concept if you want to call it that um, of course I've done no aligning or anything like that it's it's meant to be a pleated skirt now obviously the length of it is just long enough to cover the underwear and um, all, all this stuff's like should I do this, should I do that, so, but I thought I'd put it out, put it up there so that if people want to download it or play it, um, this one's not remixable, but for example like if you change the colour, it literally does not change the colour of the skirt, the skirt's always going to be yellow, um, but it's the feeling of the water, do do the people who, the ones that are like the previous ones and stuff like that, if they like it they can give it a thumbs up, and if I get a decent amount of thumbs up I'll go okay then people are liking it I'll use this method to make a full outfit for it um, it's going to be obviously it's going to be a layered outfit so the top will go over the top of the bra piece and the skirt will obviously like this one here is separate from the underwear um, the the eyes I'm still humming and humming with making them actually movable or not. The eyebrows, it'll have eyebrows and hair. Now, as you can tell, it's not, again, none of my creations I go for realism, mainly because of the seams. If you make a character look realistic, and I've, I've spoken about it before, the seams, when you if you if you get it perfectly seamless when it's in a T pose or an A pose or, or whatever you want to call it, then it looks great standing still. The second you start moving those joints, you'll get weird poke throughs, weird gaps, and stuff. It's like I'm trying to avoid all that sort of stuff. So that's why I go for a stylized look. Because if you get some of that, like as you can see here, like the crease on the, the top of the hip there, the elbows, you can see the crease. But you can look past it because it's a stylized character. So the skirt, again, this is a testing skirt. It's, I've quickly thrown it in the it's actually not bad. There's very very minimal poke through. If I run and then stop, it's very minimal. Um, moving around, you get very very minimal poke through. So it it's a viable skirt as as it stands. But I didn't go through. I haven't given it any collisions or anything like that. That's all still up in the air. What I might do is see the bottom ring. Maybe make the bottom ring of the squares collidable with the the upper legs and that way when you're moving like that it might collide but then if I do that and it starts getting weird reactions it's like then I have to abandon that um, of course that like when you jump how the legs poke through the skirt that annoys the living crap out of me um, the Miku Miku if anyone knows anything about the uh, Vocaloids the program, um, I really love that program. It's got the dynamics of cloth and it actually looks really nice. And when you get cloth simulations that look really nice, that there's nothing better, like, in my opinion. When it comes to computer stuff, if you get, even in movies, if you get like the, the original Shrek, when that first came out and um, Princess Fiona's dress, it moved they fudged it a bit but then it moved and it looked like a real cloth and it's like at the time it's like yes that looks cool and it's like yeah so that's what I'm trying to achieve in this but 
when it's restricted to using blocks or sculpts connected together and not it doesn't I've, I've explained it before it doesn't use polygons it doesn't use triangles and all that it uses flex and solid solid uh, it's like sculpted pieces of sand and each sand piece can't bend because it's sand so therefore you've got to trick it to look so that's why I've got little squares they're all like if I bring it together um, and look at it and, you, and I show you they got x-ray you can see like there is a butt ton of um, things in there and that is purely to give it the the flopping around look now to add the extras of hitting the leg and stuff like that that's that's the challenge like do I try because if I then try and then when I when your character walks it can't stretch in that sort of movement and then it's like it freaks out pokes through gets jammed and, stuff, and starts freaking out it's not gonna look good and that's where I've got to decide do I go for a oh there's a bit of poke through but it's not freaking out or do I go for oh that looks great when it moves properly but will it freak out um, at the moment I'm, ha I'm happy with how it sits now obviously uh, as you can see here at the top part here that 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 ring there I'd, ha I'd, I'd sculpt this up and make it come over the top and kind of sculpt it so those pleats will fit into the top so it doesn't look too out of place and if I was to remake another version of it and release it I think the length I think it needs a little bit extra length I think it's a little bit too short um, if I do a, for example, if I back out, and if I do a remix, and come in here and grab just the skirt, oop, one too far. Uh, let's grab that. I'll move it so you can see it. So if I move it, there's the skirt. So the skirt is, it's a ring with a, a strip of squares basically, and they're all touched, uh, touched, grouped together, or with hinges joints this sort of stuff so I could just grab that and enlarge it and make a bigger skirt but then you get that happening so to make a longer skirt I would have to come in here and I don't know whether this will work with this and grab a bat and do that with each piece uh, trying to be fussy here now doing this will affect uh, let's see if I can get under there and get the one that's can I see it? Uh, oh my god it's so tricky there it is right there so there I've lengthened it and I haven't adjusted it but if you look at the uh, things they're doing this whole thing it, it's probably still gonna work fine like if I come into here yeah, it still moves relatively fine. So it could be viable just to adjust this, tweak this, and align it a little bit better, and just release this one. That's why I put it up. It's like, what do you think? Like, yeah, see how it's like spreading out if I lengthen it? So that would have to take adjustments. Um, so if you're on Dreams, um, and you're following me in any way or all that, or you're following this creation, um, if you come into the creation, which is... Oh, I didn't do it from that one, I've done it from that one. If you're following this creation, um, just go across to the um, genealogy and then go to either remixes and see what it's remixed as or used in. Um, it's used in that because it's used in a, a, a collection, but there's the, as you can see, with the test skirt. So if you're, if you're following it already, it's easy enough to find, just do that. And then give it a play, like you won't be able to edit it because it's only playable. Give it a play and if you think it's, if you think that is fine, just tweak that and then release it. Um, give it a thumbs up, and if I get enough thumbs up on it, I'll go. You know what? I'll tweak it a little bit and release it and make it remixable instead of just being playable. Um, it hasn't got this one. Hasn't got the. the I'm trying to look up so you can see the. There's no cube on this one, um, whereas the other one actually has the cube still on it. So if you go to that one and go to view that one. 
this one here, if you look up, it's got a cube above it, and when you walk out, it goes into the sunlight. Um, so none of that mechanic has changed at all. It's still exactly, that one there is still exactly the same puppet. All I've done is added the skirt as a, a feedback thing. It's like, do you think that that is good enough as a skirt? Because um, I'm, I could take it or leave it. Um, me personally, if it was for my own personal creation, I would sit here and fiddle with it. But as a, a puppet that people could throw in their creations or they could use it to see how I do the, my creation, that sort of stuff, I could go either way. Um, oh, there's a little bit of poke through there, but very minimal. Um, so yeah, if you're on Dreams, give it a thumbs up if you think it's fine. If it doesn't get enough thumbs up, I'll know people, okay, either not enough people have seen it or people don't think it's good enough, maybe try something different. Because I do have other creations that use completely different skirt systems. Um, I prefer this one because if you squint your eyes, <laughs> Actually, 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 I could probably, actually, if I do this, I could probably, <coughs> excuse me, if I do this, then we'll grab a uh, camera lighting effects, if I grab, uh, is it that one? Uh, if I blur it up a bit, what do we reckon, about 60? So, I've given it a slight blur. Now, if you're not... Oh, no, it's still not quite. If you're not focusing on the fact there's little squares there, it does give the... Again, squint your eyes, it does give the cloth feel to it. Um, let's add some more. Let's see if we can get... Try 75. Actually, turn that. 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 Oh yeah, there you, yeah. So you can't, you can't re unless you focus now. You can't see the the squares, and it does look like it's a cloth. Um, so yeah, that's that's where I'm at. That's what's like. I've put it up as a playable. So if you come up into my creation, uh, 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 if I one more, and then go to here and go to. Saved online, so only the ones online now is there. You can see there it is there, but it's it's got the little controller, so it's playable. These ones here have got the like the recycle icon, which means they're remixable. So it's only as a playable. Just like that one's only as a playable. This one here is a as I showed you, it's got a hair, it's got the eyebrows, it's got the blinking eyes, it's uh it's got the mouth and all that. That's what we'll get added to this, something along those lines. But just like that one there is a showcase and this one is a showcase it's if you like it give it a thumbs up that's got one thumb up so like that skirts a quick throw together the hair that the base of the hair is i've sculpted it and the strandy parts is a creation i've already made which is available for, for the use um this one here the skirt is a completely new creation i've, I've plonked it down wired it up it's like okay Let's put it out, if people think it's good enough, I can make a, just tweak it a little bit and make this a remixable. So, instead of being playable listed, it'll be remixable listed. Um, that creation there is literally something I threw together. It's got the eyes, which I think I spoke about these ones here. If you, um, actually I can show you on that one because you can see the problem I'm having with it. The eyes look at the camera so when you come around like they do look at the camera so if you go like down like that it, they will always focus on where you are but if i move them and stop the eyes bulge forward if i move to the side they bulge bulge the way the character's moving um and that's the issue i was having with that it's like <clears throat> so it's like i didn't bother pursuing it any further release it um so i put that and this survival chip which is just the red things of food uh, if you come back here, that water up there is water, so you stand in it, drink uh, with square. Um, the ground is a piece, uh, there's a sand version, a grass version. The rock is a sculpt, just move it around, rescale it, whatever you want. You shouldn't have to do any sculpting, same with the trees. Um, 
the trees have the fruit attached to them and with a random spawner so if if you want to use it and you don't like where the fruit's sitting go up, scope into it move the fruit around um, it will randomly spawn you can walk up click on it get some food um, when the food's in there triangle to eat the food um, so yeah let me know what you think of the skirt um, on dreams by giving it a thumbs up uh, I kind of wish there was a way you can give it a thumbs down as well but comment go into the comment sections over here comment say yeah it looks good but I reckon you need to do this or that sort of stuff feedback constructive feedback not not hate not well, not constructive feedback like oh it's too short or I don't like the color colors easily changed that kind of stuff so I'm out of here stay safe and I'll catch you on next time